right, y'all. What's going on? What is going on? We back with another up church vlog, <coughs> and it's called uh, Sun Sunday Sir Man. <laughs> he had like I told y'all once before, weird types. But on that note, let's go on and get into it. See what he's talking about. But wait, there's more. All right, guys, let's talk about the term female. He's going to tell us about himself. <laughs> oh, shit. Female is a word that can be used to describe somebody of the female sex. <gasps> Are you fucking serious? <laughs> Gee, will you solve world hunger next for us? Now, that isn't just humans. That is also animals. Move over, Elon Musk. This dude knows what's up. <laughs> now see this part two to the other one I am gonna react to the other one I got y'all I got you but we gonna go and just react to this one but <laughs> he trolling him man church up there so when you say females always tripping over blank it could mean anything uh alright oh, really no shit what the fuck you said blank it could mean anything <laughs> women be tripping over extension cords. Women be tripping over cinder blocks. Women be tripping over a guy who tripped. Insert word here. All you gotta do is imagination. It could mean anything. Imagination. <laughs> I mean, it seems y'all are pretty good at that. Look at him. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> speaking facts like it's women out there that are dressing up like men or you don't you think they're men like a lot of people think I'm a whole dude and I'm a female but they think I'm a dude by the way I dress and my hair cut like they straight up think I'm a dude like <laughs> the church do got a point like straight up female can be a male straight up Straight up nowadays, yeah, most definitely. They act like men, not women, which is why they date men. When have you ever heard a woman be like, oh man, he's so hot? <laughs> he didn't strip me of my humanity or call me a female at all. Hmm, let me think. Never. Hate to bust Thanks. your beta bubble, but you know, some women like their hair pulled, their ass smacked, and like to be called names. It reminds me. Facts. Like, there's some women out there, I don't like this shit. Like, I just told y'all, mm -mm. I like women, like, no. But uh, other females out there, like that. Straight up. A whole lot of when people called women bitches. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Now women call guys like you bitches. Nobody needs you to advocate for how difficult it is to use gender neutral. You look like the Cheeto Tiger fuck Billy Eilish. Shut up. Nobody Damn. said that the gender binary was easy. Well, it's not easy or hard because it's not even fucking real. These are my pronouns. You will use them. Eh, no, because people like me don't talk to people like you. Facts. You will not refer to me. Facts. Weird O's. Like, no. First of all, you and you were not the man to do shit. <laughs> Straight up, like what the fuck? <laughs> Come on. Well, I wouldn't even stand three feet away from you, so. If you misgender me by mistake, fix it and move on. You are a female. I don't need your elaborate apology. Well, we also don't need an elaborate video to know that you're female. If someone else misgender. Fags, like you are born a female, you will always be a female till the day you die. Like that's what God created you to be. 
a female. People nowadays try to get their gender change. No, I'm a male now, even though I was born a female. I, I'm a um, I'm a female now, even though I was born a male. No, just because you change your private area doesn't mean that's what you label as. It might seem like uh, I'm labeled as this, but in God's eyes. You labeled as what he created you to the day you die. It's simple as that. So when they bury you, you know what's going to be on that piece of paper? Whatever you were born as. Straight up. Like, just because you changed it, don't mean that the whole, like, you just literally changed your fem is you a female or male label. No, you were always, whatever you born as, that's what you label as. Now you can change yourself and be able to fuck you want to, but when the day you die, that's gonna be on the paper. You always that no matter what you can get breast, ass, you can get a whole penis, and you can get the penis removed, and you can get uh, a six pack, but whatever you born as. That's what's gonna. That's what you gonna die. No matter how much you change on your body. Simple as that. It's female and it's males in this world. Just cause you change yourself, in God eyes, He know what He made. You can change. You can change and live your life whatever you wanna do. But the day you die, that's what you gonna. You gonna die as what you was born as. They're going to put that on a piece of paper and be like, well, this is the man. They're going to go, no, this is a female. No, this is a whole man. Just because she, you know, he, she got breast and ass now. When the day you die, if you born a female, they're going to put that as a female, even though you change yourself into a man. When I'm gone... It's just because I dress like this and I got my hair cut. Guess what? When I'm gone, female. Simple as that. Gender's mate, it is never your job to tell them that it's okay. Because it isn't. Whatever, woman. I get it. The discussion of the gender spectrum confuses you, and that's fine. I don't think anyone cares. <laughs> Thanks. Don't anything about it, don't fucking speak. What's there to know? <laughs> it's fictional. Up. There are non-binary people, there are trans men who, who lactate, there are those who go by he, him, different pronouns. It's just inclusive to everybody. It is not hurting cis women to say chest feeding, but it does hurt those who go by other pronouns to continue to say breastfeeding, especially if they have body dysmorphia. Titties, 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 <laughs> you're a female. What are your Facts, like damn, get it through your mind. Like, I mean, you had the freedom to talk and to speak your opinion, but you always be a female. Exactly. A lot of people say, "Oh, you look just like your daddy." I'm gonna always look like him, of course. That's my daddy. But at the end of the day, I know what I am. You know, I can date whoever I want to, male, female. But at the end of the day, I am a female. <laughs> titties, 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 like church said. <laughs> to continue to say breastfeeding, especially if they have body dysmorphia. Titties, 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 you're a female. What are your preferred pronouns? Uh, they, them. Oh, I've never heard those before. Where are they? Uh, they're what's known as neo pronouns. What are neo pronouns? They're basically your own custom pronouns. When no other pronouns seem to fit, you come up with your own pronouns. Anything can really be a pronoun. Oh, how do I use them? Um, it depends on the person and their pronouns. They, them follows a similar spelling to Red they and them. Fuck. And even similar grammar rules like there and there. So they, them, themselves, 
there's things like that. Oh, okay. And there are other new pronouns you said? Well, yeah, because they're customizable. Anything can be a pronoun, really. Oh, I didn't realize that you can customize your own pronouns. That's pretty cool. Thank you. No, it's not cool. It's, um, it's flat out fucking stupid. But yeah, it is. It looks like you wrote shit all over your face, <laughs> made up some words, and now you think the whole world <laughs> revolves around your stupid ass. And I strongly <laughs> believe that is a level-headed observation. Hi, I'm Jax, and I- Hey, real tall, real tall. Church, just straight up, real tall. Like, some of these people be saying the weirdest shit ever, and if you just look at them like, why the fuck is this person talking? That's the way I was looking when she was just talking, like, damn. I just came up with new neo pronouns that combine he, him, she, her, and they, them. And no one gives a shit at all except for you. So hear me out. Alright, I'm listening. They, them, theirs, okay? They, them, their, whatever you want to consider it, right? Let's take the first one, the, okay? This combines she, he, and they, right? They. The. That's what they said, you know? That's what they said. Sure. Next, we got them, right? Okay, so then we got, that's just combining them and him. Them. What the fuck? You're saying them. You're just spelling them the incorrect way. You didn't do anything special. Yeah? No, I don't know. No one fucking knows. Last one, <laughs> theirs, okay? It's just like theirs, oh, but like also like hers. Shit. Theirs. That jacket's theirs. Is this what consumes y'all's time? <laughs> what are you doing with your fucking life? Thanks. You need hobbies. You, you need a hobby. Tips on how you can be a better intersex ally. When it comes to inclusive language, oftentimes people tend to use phrases like people with penises or people with vaginas rather than saying male and female or men and women. While this can absolutely be inclusive for trans people, unfortunately it's not always the most inclusive language for intersex people. My advice is to use language that focuses on function and not just form. That means focusing on the actual function that you're talking about, such as people who can get pregnant, people who can get other people pregnant, people who are at risk of testicular cancer, and so on and so forth. This is much more inclusive because there are intersex people who are born with a vagina but don't have a uterus or ovaries or an ability to menstruate. This is because some people that are born with a penis don't have testes. So it's much more inclusive to say what you actually mean than it is to use language that works around that. You know, the dating pool for you people must be pretty goddamn slim. Uh, really something. Like, say? he's speaking facts. Like, come on. I got. I went to sleep while she was talking. I was literally dozing the fuck off. Come on, man. Like I just said, you're either a female or you're a male. Stop adding these new difficult words that you're trying to put together. Come the fuck on. I don't care if you're, uh, oh, that person is a stud, that person is a, is a girly girl, whatever word you want to come up with. Uh, oh, that per uh, oh, she is, she a whole dude. Uh, Oh, uh, now he a whole female, a, a woman. Come on. At the end of the day, it's just female, male. I don't care if you're gay, straight, bi, confused, whatever. At the end of the day, it's still female and male. Straight up. Like, lay beside each other and go... Like breathe on each other? Like what, what I don't <laughs> breathe on each other. I'm going fishing. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh baby, baby, baby. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that. I like it. You know, church is going to troll you, especially when you're doing some, saying some ignorant shit, especially. That's right up his alley, straight up. But y'all let me know what y'all think about that in the comments. Give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. 
And on that note, Smokey J Gang, catch me in the next video. I'm out.